Now to your election watch coverage on this Tuesday night. Let's start out with News 5's Allison Zimmerman. She's live in Colorado Springs tracking key races, including 2C going toward the road projects across the growing area. Allison. And Elizabeth, those ballot questions are what County Clerk Chuck Broerman is partially crediting to the large voter turnout this time around that and the growing population now in Colorado Springs on the ballot. Several school districts have different school board elections, but what we're really watching closely tonight are the two city questions 2B and 2C. Now earlier today, our cameras captured the nonstop cars circling through to drop off their ballots, and I can tell you that hasn't stopped. We've been seeing a steady stream all night tonight with 2B and 2C. A lot of voters deciding in terms of how money should be spent and how much you should pay for various projects. Now, as we've mentioned, supporters of 2B say the budget is less for parks than it was 12 years ago, and there are major needs in the park system. If voters give their approval, the city will have $7 million to put towards these improvements. And that's, of course, not all on the table in the spring's ballot issue 2C, asking to renew a sales tax increase to pay for road projects. That increase, however, is actually a slight decrease from what voters approved back in 2015. Still, on both of these issues, opponents say the city doesn't need any more money. We're going to continue to track these results once they come in tonight, uh, starting at 7. So ballot boxes will close at 7 o'clock. So you've got a little less than an hour if you haven't done that just yet. Always watching out for you, Southern Colorado. Allison Zimmerman, News 5.